Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from Santa Anita Park, Arcadia, California on Thursday afternoon, October the 20th, and this is my Echo Base Winter Circle Southern California Racing Report. Let's take a look at race 7 this afternoon, folks, 4.07 p.m. Pacific Post Time, 8.5 furlong route test on the dirt track, 3 year rolls and up race for an optional claiming prize of some $51,000. Contenders number one, Donato, number four, Summer Movie, number three, Kate's Event, and number five, Quality Council. Number one, Donato, takes a class drop of five units as the pace profile leader in this optional claiming field, racing at or about tonight's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt, has been a power run performer in four straight, including power run wins at both his second and fourth races back, which of course is indicative of a bounce pattern, folks. The bounce will be up positive this afternoon. If this pattern continues. Number four summer movie a five to one shot. The overall speed leader in this field also drops in class has turned in power run performances facing better company in each of his last three starts. Race seven summary number one Donato tops my contenders list which also includes number four summer movie, number three Kate's event and number five quality council one four three five and the seven from Santa Anita. Bonus long shots, Hawthorne, race three, entry number five, Peter Lewis, a six to one shot, a track master plus power pony qualifier is the overall speed leader in this maiden field, racing at or about today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt. Thistle Downs, race five, the four to one shot, number six, Bello Papa, his speed figure sprinting at today's distance of six furlongs on the dirt, which are equivalent to the favorite. Number four, Jacks again. So from Santa Anita on a Thursday as we open up over the racing week here in Southern California, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.